Hey YouTube, this is Primetime Pokemon. I'm here with part two of me opening a Legendary Treasures Pokemon Booster Box. This is part of my 16 Pokemon Booster Box opening series that I'm doing on YouTube. You can find a link to that series in the video description of this video, as well as a link to part one if you're just watching part two before part one. In part one, I did have several good pulls, so you definitely want to check that out. And I'll open up the second half of this box now. And I did get this booster box from Blowout Cards for $94.95. First pack here has Genesect on it. I'm still hoping to pull a secret rare card from this set. Definitely the most valuable card that you can get in the set. First pack here, first card is Snivy. There's a Dwebble. Krogunk. Natu. Reverse Hollow or Hollow. Ew, nice start. It's a Charizard Hollow. Definitely set that one aside. Next is a Rare Gallade. And then the Radiant Collection cards, Eevee and Torchic. And the Uncommons are Crustle and Carnivine. Very good way to start off the second half of the box with a Charizard Hollow. Next pack. Starts off with a Charmander, then a Sawaddle, Piplup, Zoroa, Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Spiritomb Reverse Hollow, just an uncommon card. Rare is a Tangrowth, and then the Radiant Collection, Meloetta EX Full Art, second of the box of Meloetta EX Full Art. Actually, my mistake, this is actually just a regular EX, so it's the first regular EX from the Radiant Collection set I pulled. Second RC card is Mancino, and then the two uncommons are Carnivine and Altaria. So two good packs in a row. Start this video off. Pack with Reshiram on it. There is a Gibble. Ralts, Sewaddle, Piplup, Hollow Reverse Hollow is a Lucario Hollow. Add that to the collection of Hollows over here. Zatu is the non hollow rare. Radiant Collection, Shaman EX Full Art, second Shaman of the box. And then the second Radiant Collection card is Audino, followed by a Druddygon. And Gabite Uncommon card. So three good packs in a row now. Fourth pack now. Genesect on the outside there. Starts off with Ralt. There is a Minchino. Gothita. Gibble. Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Rayquaza Hollow. Another very powerful Hollow card. Then there is a Ninetales non-hollow rare card, followed by a Namolga ultra rare Radiant Collection full art. So excellent pulls there, a very good series of packs there. And Ursaring is the second RC card in the pack, followed by an uncommon Charmeleon and Plusle. So quite happy with my pulls so far, I've really started to heat up. Hopefully my luck continues with this Reshiram pack. Still waiting on that secret rare, either Reshiram or Zekrom. Okay, this pack starts out with Vulpix. There is a Swablu. Natu. Dwebble. Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Tepig, just a common card. Rare is a Seismitoad. Radiant Collection, Superior. And the second one is Audino. And then the two uncommons, Sablai and Energy Switch. So a down pack there compared to the packs I had had. But hopefully my luck will continue here. I should pull a couple more Ultra Rares you would think. So we have a Woobat, Minchino, Solosis, Gibble, Rare or Reverse Hollow is a Minchino, Reverse Hollow, which is a common card. Whoa, I was going to say rare. It is an Excadrill EX card. I believe this Excadrill EX is 
solely in this set. It's not a reprint or anything. Very nice pull right there. That is only my third regular EX from the box. And then Gardevoir is an RC card. Minchino is the second RC. And then Crushing Hammer and Double Colorless Energy are the two uncommons in the pack. Pretty good pull so far in the second half of the box. All right, this pack starts with Solosis. There's a Tepig, Timpole, Swablu, Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Zekrom Hollow. Pretty cool looking card. I don't think I pulled this card yet. And then there's an Empoleon, non hollow rare, two RC cards, Purloin and Servine, and then two uncommons, Cedric Juniper and Bianca. Okay, next up, pack with Reshram on it. There is an Oshawott, Trubbish, Timpole, Zorua, Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Vulpix, just a common. Rare card after that is a Toxicroak, non hollow. Two RC cards, Cinchino and Ralts. And then two uncommons, Bianca and Crustle. Next pack, Zekrom on it. Okay, so there is a Dino, Natu, Swablu, Mischievous, Reverse Hollow or Hollow is a Hollow Cobalion. Some very good Pokemon cards here, especially in Hollow form. Gyarados is the non Hollow rare right after it. Then there is a Growlithe RC card followed by an Ursaring. Then the two uncommons, Altaria and Gabite. Next up, Mewtwo Pack. Okay, so there is a Ralts, Woobat, Solosis, Trubbish, ooh, a nice Garchomp Hollow. Seems like all the powerful Pokemon are in holographic form in this set. Oh wow, I didn't even notice I was putting my hollow over here in the Zekrom EX, another very powerful Pokemon. I believe that is the fourth regular EX card I've pulled, not in the Radiant Collection subset. And then there is two RC cards, Pikachu and Snivy, and then two uncommon cards, Swoobat and Pignite. So awfully good pack there, you can't beat a hollow in an EX card. Pack here has Genesect on it. Okay, the pack starts off with Oshawott. There's a Vulpix, Dino, Mischievous, Rare or Reverse Hollow is a Palpitoad Reverse Uncommon card. Rare card is a Meloetta. Radiant Collection card is a Reshiram Full Art. That's another ultra rare card. That is the second Reshiram Full Art I've pulled this box. And then there is a Teddy Ursus, the second RC card. And then Minin and Pignite are the two uncommon cards. Okay, almost through the second half of this Legendary Treasures booster box. There are six packs left after this one. Hopefully my good luck continues. We have Solosis. Krogunk, Magikarp, Charmander, Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Genesect Hollow. Pretty cool looking there. Set that aside. And then there is a Ninetales, non hollow rare. RC cards are Superior and Servine. And then the two uncommons, another Servine and a Curlia. Next up here, a pack that has Zekrom on it. Starts off with a Trubbish, Vulpix, Gothita, 
Tangela, hollow or reverse hollow, is a Gothitelle hollow. Quite a few hollows I've pulled in this box so far. Then there is a Rayoniclus, non-hollow rare, Gardevoir, RC card, and a Alessa RC card, followed by two uncommons, Gotharita and Duwat. Four packs left after this one, so five more chances to get a secret rare card, either Reshram or Zekrom. Really hoping to get one of those two. There is a Sawawl, a Magikarp, Mischievous, Rare or Reverse Hollow. After this card, Gibble is a Prinplup, which is an uncommon card. Then the Rare is a Fion, that's a non-hollow. RC card is a Mew EX Full Art, and that is the second Mew EX Full Art I've pulled this box. Set that over there. And then there is an Earth Ring for the second RC. And then Shuckle and Carnivine are the two uncommon cards from the Legendary Treasure set. Next pack here. This pack starts off with Tepig. There is a Timpole. Swablu. Gothita. Hollow or Reverse Hollow is a Reshram Reverse Hollow. I know I pulled this card in Hollow form earlier in the box. And the Rare is a Seismitoad, non-Hollow. And then RC cards, Piplup and Torchic, followed by the two uncommons, Prinplup and Shuckle. Okay, third to last pack here in this Legendary Treasures Booster Box. Like I said, still really hoping for that secret rare. There is a Magikarp, Suwawl, Tangela, Tepig, Reverse Hollow or Hollow, is a Hydrogen Hollow. Set that aside. And then there is a Zatu for the rare non-hollow, followed by an ultra rare Meloetta EX Full Art. Set that aside, and that is the second EX Full Art of Meloetta. Second RC card in the pack is Audino, followed by two uncommons, Energy Switch, and a Druddy Gun. Okay, so we have second to last pack here with Reshiram on it. Starts off with a Dino. It has Gothita, Tangela, Tepig, Reverse Hollow or Hollow card is a Trubbish Reverse Hollow common card, followed by the ooh, Black Kyurem EX. So followed by the ultra rare Black Kyurem EX. A pretty good card right there. That makes four EX cards in this half the box. And then two RC cards, Stunfisk and Alessa. And then the two uncommon cards, Crushing Hammer and Curlia. Last pack in the Legendary Treasures Booster Box. Hoping to get this Pokemon right here, Zekrom, in that last booster pack. It'll really make the booster box worth it. Take a look here. We have Snivy. There is Sawaddle. Zorua. Dwebble, Reverse Hollow or Hollow, is a Krogunk, which is just a common card. And then the rare card... Miss Magius, so it doesn't look like a secret rare in this box at all. That's the non hollow rare. Followed by the two RC cards, Piplup and Teddy Ursa. And then the two uncommon cards, Cedric Juniper and Curlia. So disappointing that I didn't get that secret rare card, but I did pull several ultra rare cards out of the box. I can summarize here for you. First off, hollow cards. I pulled the Charizard that I really wanted, but total. Let me count them up here. I pulled 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19 hollows out of the box, which is awfully good. I pulled out 5 EX cards, regular EX, the Meloetta EX from the RC set, and then 6 EX full art cards from that collection subset, and 4 full art cards. So pretty good. Pulls overall, just disappointed I didn't get that secret rare, 
But thanks everyone for watching. Again, this video is part of my 16 Pokemon Booster Box opening series that I'm currently doing on YouTube. You can find a link to that in the video description of this video. And you can also find links to my Facebook blog and Twitter pages in the video description of this video as well. So thanks everyone for watching and stay tuned for more videos. Thank you.